Hey guys, it's Hadrian here. Um, how's everyone doing today? Hope you guys are having a splendiferous day. Yes, that is today's word of the day. Splendiferous. Um, and yes, that is a word. I <laughs> learned it for... What's that standardized test that everyone takes? That SATs, yes. So, today, um, <laughs> my hair is a hot mess. And I am going to be showing you guys a quick hair tutorial about how I get my coarse, wavy, hot mess hair um, nice and smooth and still have volume in it. Um, now this is pretty good for almost all hair types, um, and, but this is just the hair type that I have. Crazy. So, uh, <laughs> I'm actually filming this video right before I do a Brazilian blowout, so if you guys want to see that video sooner, let me know, leave me a comment down below. Um, and I would love to do a hair tutorial for how I perform a Brazilian blowout on my crazy head of hair. Now, I love doing that before summer. Um, spring is happening right now and it's getting really hot and my hair is getting really frizzy. So, whenever like I do any like kind of heat styling with my hair, any drop of moisture gets my hair frizzy, especially at the roots, and it just like works its way up until my whole head is a hot, hot mess. But, there are some products you can use to counteract that, but sometimes the humidity is just too great and my hair just puffs up like a puffball, and sometimes the only way to prevent that is from doing a Brazilian blowout, which I am a super fan of. And I will show you guys how to do that, but not in this video, and I don't know why I keep talking about it, but this video, I'm going to show you guys how I get a nice, smooth, voluminous hairstyle, which is pretty, like, uh, which is um, a technique that you can use for almost any hair types. And the first thing that you have to do is start off with fresh, wet hair, which I will do right now. Alright, so here is my hair freshly washed. Now the things that we're going to be using first are going to be blow dryer. I'm going to use the Asai Brazilian um, dry oil. Tresemme Keratin Smooth. That's This is the heat protectant. And at the very end, um, instant volume. This is like a talc powder by Brazilian Blowout as well. So we're just going to get one scoop, or one pump, of this in our hands. Rub it together. And go back to the front. Making sure to get those ends really well. And then we're going to spray heat protecting all over our hair. And we're going to use a round brush, and then we're going to use the blow dryer with the diffuser. Now this, or not a diffuser, a concentrator. This concentrator is going to help concentrate um, the heat onto your hair. So let's go. Now that you dry it up and into the direction that you wanted, your hair has tons of volume and it's movable and it's awesome. Now um, the next thing that we're going to use is the Brazilian Blowout. This is the, <laughs> the Instant Volume Body Powder. Now this, we're just going to sprinkle onto our roots, and this is going to give us even more volume. I just like to tap, tap, tap around. You don't have to use a ton of product. You 
And this is just going to give you extra hold and volume throughout the day. And that is pretty much all I use. I don't like to weigh my hair down. And there we go. We're all set. So let me show you kind of... And there we go. Okay guys, now that is how I get my hair nice and smooth and straight with um, volume and like tons of like movability because I hate my hair when it's like hard and sticky and I can't run my hands through it and honestly I'm like literally allergic to like almost every single like hair product out there like if it gets in my eyes it makes me like makes my eyes tear up and itchy and they get all red and they make my skin break out like crazy and I have looked for years far and wide and finally found this tiny little grouping of products that gives me everything that I need and more which is so again it's the this is the Brazilian blowout this is the Brazilian dry oil now this is like a great it smooths reconstructs and shines and this is like amazing it helps smooth down your hair so much it gives it so much life and like shine and vitality and then the tresemme this is the keratin smooth um flat ironing smoothing spray and i use this whenever i use any heat in my hair um this one i find is like the best one for me to use at least um, i love the smell of it and i love the way it makes my hair feel after i use it and there is a huge noticeable difference because I, when I first started blow drying my hair, I never used any heat protecting products and my hair was so like brittle and disgusting after <laughs> using the dryer for a while. And this like has helped so, 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 so much. So you guys never forget to leave a heat protectant out of your arsenal of hair products that you use. And then last but not least is, this is actually um, the newest product that I found that I started using and that's the Instant Volume Body Boost Powder by Brazilian Blowout as well. I've used actually a bunch of different um, talc powders like this, like the, I use the Schwarzkopf and the Bedhead and all that and I've tried it and all of them have been like too heavy I guess in my hair it makes my hair feel like gritty and I can't run my hands through it and this is the only one that I found that doesn't weigh like make my hair feel nasty and sticky and I can still run my hands through it and my hair still looks like natural and smooth and awesome and the more that you layer this into your hair the more separation and texture you're gonna get which I like so on a normal day I just use a little bit like that and then if I want it to look more polished I'll use um, a little bit more until I get like the look that I'm going for but this is awesome because it not only adds um, volume and body but it also adds shine as well which not a lot of um, the talcs do they tend to make your hair less shiny but you can also use this as a um like kind of like a dry shampoo so like the next day if your hair is getting a little oily and you don't want to like sh take a shower and wet your hair and do it all over just run this down your roots like i did initially and then just like zhuzh it up with your fingers like that and it's going to totally bring your hair back to life it's going to remove that oil and it's still going to leave your hair your hair feeling nice and shiny and light and it's totally awesome so thank you guys so so much for watching that's going to be the end of my video for today leave me a comment down below let me know what you think let me know if you've tried any of these products and let me know if you have any questions or about how i did all this and straightened my hair and kind of like my hair story because i am obsessed with my hair <laughs> it's like one of my few obsessions about myself like i like i'm always like trying to do something to it and this is finally like my like triumvirate of like my three favorite products that I use. Um, and if you guys want to see a video about like what kind of tools to use, let me know because I have a lot of information about that as well that I've learned throughout the years. 
and thank you guys so so much for watching taking some time out of your day to spend time with me and see how I do my hair maybe it'll help you guys um, I'm gonna have a tutorial for how to do a Brazilian blow up pretty soon as well because I haven't done a Brazilian blowout in months in my hair so it's probably all out already just so that I could film these videos about curly hair and all that because when I have a Brazilian blowout I don't really consider my hair that curly anymore because it kind of straightens it out and when it like gets heat on it it makes it straighter as well so it's pretty cool I'll explain it in more detail um, in that video coming up and leave me some comments down below if you want to see that sooner rather than later so thank you guys so so much for watching hope you guys have a fantastic day and I'll talk to you later bye